Hello and welcome back to Forza Horizon 5, where today I'm doing a little experiment. I'm trying to find the fastest front-wheel drive car in the game. Bit strange considering, I mean, everyone's probably, who's played this game has probably tried to find the fastest car. Uh, <coughs> thanks for the <coughs> Uh, but I wonder what the fastest front-wheel drive car is. Um, if you went in the car pass recently, you would have received this. The new 2021 Mini Cooper JCW GP. The fastest Mini ever made. It's got a 2-litre turbo engine, which produces 300 horsepower. I've upgraded it to 627. Um, it's actually pretty good. I love the massive wing on the back. Um, now, I'm going to do this, this is going to be my first candidate, so I'm just going to quickly crash through every single crash bar in Mexico and get to the highway. Uh, I will see you there. Right, so I've arrived at the motorway, which is the longest in a Forza game. Strips to the, from one corner of the map to the other, get myself in position. Right, now launch, now launch control, 3, 2, 1, go! Oh, I was on the second, there we go. Off to a good start, 100 miles an hour, 120, 30, 40, it's really racing this thing, 150, 160, 170, 180, can I hit 190? I've fitted this with a better transmission and have extended the gears, so it should be fine. 183, 184. Is that going to be downhill at some point? 187. Come on, it. Come on, little mini. A190. Oh, Q going. 192. 193! 195! Can we hit 195? Ah, uh, no, I don't think we can. Little Mini's giving up 192 miles an hour. Now that is properly fast. That's good. That's going to gap a lot of supercars, that is. Just imagine that. Uh, fun fact: The first Mini Cooper was actually uh, the first Mini Coopers were actually built in um, Birmingham and also Oxford, where I live. I thought it would be wrong not to include this car, the new Honda Civic Type R. Well, newish, and then there's another one coming out. I cannot wait to see it. Uh, this one is actually one of the. It's actually the fastest front-wheel drive car at the moment, I think. Um, this goes at 170 miles an hour stock. Oh my god, I'm sorry, breached 170. Already got the mini, of the lag, 200 miles an hour. And this car's currently got six, seven, nearly 700 horsepower from its turbo rally engine, 220. 230. Keep going, little Honda. Keep going. Two, three, seven, two, eight, and two hundred and forty miles an hour in the Honda Civic Type R from twenty eighteen. And can I get any more? Two hundred forty one. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, no, two fifty, two four eight. That's good enough. Now apply the brakes, and we will peel off the motorway and have a look at our next car. Now for one of the all-time great cars on this list, the most, one of the most famous sleeper cars on this list, the Volvo 850R. Uh, this is the, this had a five-cylinder engine, well, as a lot of Volvos did back then. Um, uh, I think it had about 250 horsepower, I'd say. 
Uh, now I've fitted it with a new engine, which is from the Toyota Supra. In this game, if you fill this turbo to the Toyota Supra engine, you will get over a thousand horsepower. And this has a thousand two hundred and seventy brake horsepower. And look at it! That turbo is really kicking in. It's really boosting it. Come on. 250. It's already beaten the Honda. Can it go any further? I'll tell I tell you, this thing is going to be quick. I think it's still got more to give. It's on staring like a pig, but I think it's still got more to give. Two, 260. 263, 64. 270 miles an hour from the Volvo. That is a new record. That is quick. That is speedy. Now that is impressive from the Swedes. Well done, Volvo. Um, um, however, this was a bit of a pig to drive. A lot of understeer and a lot of crashes. Yeah. I think you get the idea. Now on to another new car from the car pass. This is the Oldsmobile Tornado. The muscle car that isn't actually a muscle car. This thing is sort of an executive car. A bit like, well, I can't really to say, well, like a BMW 5 Series or something? I don't know, the equivalent back in the day. Um, this is actually front wheel drive and has a big V8 up front. However, I've given it a bigger V8. A 7.4 litre twin turbo V8 from a sand rail. Which are these crazy overpowered buggies that just go ripping through the dunes in, in countries like America and Dubai. And they're powered by insane crazy engines. And and they can even do wheelies, it's ridiculous. I mean, I've seen these on YouTube, they're unbelievable. However, this thing's kind of heavy, so I'm not expecting much. I mean, the power ratio is almost 1 to 1. This thing's got over 1,700 horsepower. But it weighs 1,600 kilos. It's one of the heaviest cars on the list. Come on, can it hit 250? If it hits 250, come on. 247. Come on. Come on, Oldsmobile. Oh, it's given up at 247. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now the last one. Uh, this one's a death trap. The little Honda Civic Type R Civic RS from 1924. This thing has now got a twin turbo, 1,000 horsepower LS V8 from I think it's a Chevrolet SS. Um, and well, look at it. Off it goes. This thing only weighs 750 kilos. So, it's got a pretty compact weight ratio. Off it goes. Over 200 already. Can I keep boosting? Oh god. Forget to upgrade the tyres. No grip. Uh, I'm just gonna... There you go. One. Crash. Rewind again. Can I go back? Oh my god! It actually flipped. Alright, oh, that is not gonna happen again. Um, come on. Stay more. Uh, come on, not again. Come on, little Honda. Come on, yes! I got you round. Uh, it seems like a pain. You can't, you can't steer it. You can't steer it. There's no steering. Oh my god. This thing's impossible to drive. Come on, the steering doesn't do anything. Oh my god. It's drifting. It's drifting. How can it drift as front wheel drive? Come on, little Honda. 210, 215, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 220. Come on, keep going. Can you hit 230? Up to my gear. I'm having gears. Come on, come on, Honda. Hang in there, buddy, come on. We're going down to the downhill. 227, 28, 29, 30. 1, 2, 3, 4. Keep going. Still pulling. Can it be this big brother? 240. Oh, it might. It might. 241? 241. 2. 243. Oh, that's it. It gave up. That was a good run from the Honda. 
that was a really good run. So there you have it. The fastest front wheel drive car in Forza Horizon 5, the Volvo 850R. And you can give it a round of applause. It, that is, a, it's a legend in my mind. I love that car. Now, I'm going to extend this challenge to you guys. And uh, now there are a few rules. It must, A, the car must be front wheel drive. And, well, if you are not allowed to go into the tuning menu and find an all-wheel drive car and then turn it into front wheel turn it into front wheel drive if you put the power to the front all the front wheels don't do that I'm not allow that that won't count uh, so if you can find a car that's faster than the 850R your record to beat is 270 miles an hour uh, good luck um, I'm gonna end this video here um, uh, please like and subscribe this video, please comment, turn on that notification bell. Also don't forget to subscribe to me on TikTok and follow me on Instagram. Uh, I hope to see you guys again soon with another video. Uh, goodbye.